Hey, this is Scott with Travify, and we're excited to announce library sharing in your Travify account. So we'll do a quick walkthrough of how to turn on library sharing uh, for specific items, and then show you how you can share those out with others and how they can access them, how you can access others, uh, other Travify users that have shared content, uh, and be able to review that content and copy it to your Travify account to use on itineraries and proposals. It's a very powerful new feature uh, that really it helps uh, leverage uh, the great community of Travify users out there. So let's take a look at how you can do that. So in your Travify account, firstly, you'll go to the library and then on any specific item within here, you can go ahead and select an item and over on the right side, you'll see a new button that's labeled share. You can select that and then you'll see an option for share library template to web. Uh, you'll go ahead and select that. Uh, it will turn on these defaults within here that then you can optionally choose to allow that item to be copied to other users' accounts. Generally speaking, I would suggest that you leave that on uh, so other users can uh, take advantage of the content that you're sharing out there, but that's totally optional. You can choose to do that. And then in the future, we do plan to make it easier to be able to search and find this content. So go ahead and leave the include and search option uh, open so that others can find that content when we do turn that search on. Now you're always in control of these uh, sharing settings, so you can also turn these off at any times to make that content not available for others to be able to view uh, or um, to be able to copy to their account. So just as as an FYI on that. So again, you'll go into your library, click on a specific item, choose share, and then check the box for share library template to web. That's the main thing you need to do. Now, once you've turned on the sharing, you can go ahead and you'll see a shareable link that's presented there in the window. You can just click the link icon to copy that link to your clipboard. It's as easy as that. And now you can share that out anywhere you want to go. I'll just uh, click on that link so that we can see the page that's being shared out. And so this is the shareable page for that content. You can see your profile information will be presented at the top. So you can kind of put your uh, signature, so to speak, on that, that you created this content. All of the text-based information is presented in there as well. Uh, any of the photos, videos, etc., are included in on that content. But then also if you've attached in places or locations, that's included in uh, on the content uh, within uh, the page that's being shared. So uh, that's how you can do that. Now, the person that uh, you're sharing this content out to will see an option at the top for copy to library. They can go ahead and click that to then save this content into their library in their Travify account and then be able to use that content on future itineraries and proposals. So it's a really simple process uh, for them to be able to take advantage of that content and obviously uh, for you to be able to share that out with others in there. Now to take a step back of what kinds of content that can be shared is basically anything in your library whether they are places uh, that you've added in like you see here I can access the share option in there uh, if they are events like the resort information we were just looking at here I can access the share option. Uh, new option, multi-events, those can be shared. That's a great way to group together multiple events or pieces of content all in a list, so to speak, so that you can group that content together. But then also, uh, forms can be shared. So you can see I have a client intake form in here. I can select that. I can also share that out uh, within there for others to be able to utilize or copy that form in there. So it's a great way to share great forms that you've built, templates that you've built, and share that out with others. So that's a quick overview on library sharing, just a walk through. We wanted to help you. We're really excited about it. But again, this is a first step. We'll be building additional ways to be able to search and find and discover content from other Travify users. But this is is a great first step uh, to be able to share content you've created or copy and save content from others that's been shared with you. Thanks so much.